Good morning. Um, today we have a new day on the Zee Adler, so called. And uh, today, as I showed you in the last episode, uh, we had problems with our uh, port engine. She wasn't running when we arrived in the harbor. So now is the day to hopefully fix the problem finally. Um, the last time we found out that the lift pump was uh, not working efficient, so we got a new lift pump from Cummins, which was not so expensive, uh, surprisingly. It was around 160 slotties, which is around $40. And I'm going to install it today, and I try to capture as much as possible and cross the fingers that the engine is going to start up later. And then we are going to tackle some other issues. Stay tuned. Welcome in the engine compartment. I want to show you my two proud 6BT Cummins uh, engines. And uh, here's the starboard engine. She's uh, running quite um, reliable and she has only 400 hours, besides that, she's already 13 years old. And there we have the heating system for the boat, which I didn't start it, but it's going to heat up all the um, radiators in the cabin so you can use the ship all the year and here on the other side we have the port engine and the port engine at the moment is without lift pump so I'm going to replace the lift pump or uh, install a new one and then I need to vent the fuel system which I have never done before and then we are going to try to start it up Yeah, so um, I'm sorry for not installing it quite away, but as you can see, there is a little pin in the engine, and I don't know if it turns on the right or left way, because when I install the pump and I install it in the wrong way, the lever comes down and breaks off the handle, and this is something I don't want to be. So I need to connect my camera with my phone, then I will start the engine and you will see how how the um, the device inside the engine is turning and then hopefully we can figure out in which way I need to install the pump.
I never ever ever lose a wrench because here it's always a hassle to find it. So now we've installed the pump. We know how the um, I'm sorry, sometimes I just don't know the English words. Um, now we know how the um, shaft is turning and it's going, um, if you're in front of the engine where the bells are, it's turning in the left direction. I don't know, left hand or left turn. So it's smashing under the pump lever and feeding in the petrol into the engine. So the next thing to avoid that this pump dies again, I'm going to install um, two fuel filters on both of the input lines. Then I'm going to flush the lines so that I have some uh, diesel coming out. And then I'm going to install the line and try to um, pump line, uh, pump diesel that it's coming out here out of out of this and out of this one. So we are sure that we have in the low pressure area we have no um, no 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 air anymore. And then on the next time we need to open this one here because that's the pump and then we know that we don't have any air in the low pressure area and then I need to open all the different injectors to find out if there is water, uh, not water, if there is air in the system and then hopefully she starts running. So cross the fingers and uh, I love working in the engine room.